Today's radical thought, managing and loan officer accountability. In training originators for over 25 years, I see repeatedly when students perform badly and are learning by doing sales programs, and I give the feedback to the manager that they should address it by removing them, the managers typically do nothing. When students don't do the work in a training program, they're not likely to put the effort in on their own job. When I ask why did they do nothing, the range of answers goes from, I need a body in the market, to I thought the training would motivate them to improve, to even blaming HR's rules for their failure to address lack of performance. The truth is that in our industry, many managers don't hold their sales staff accountable. The sad part is that they feel there is no way out of the situation. The team needs production and holding originators accountable is risky since they will quit or be recruited by another firm. Even the originators that are doing poorly seem to be recruited by another lender. It's hard to believe, but still true. But when managers fail to hold their employees accountable, they no longer are a leader. Yes, I know it's hard to find good salespeople. Everyone is looking for a good originator, but often they settle for hiring originators that I would best describe as being mediocre. So what's the solution? In a sales world where the average salesperson stays four years at a company, and in our mortgage industry, less than two years at a lender, the days of longevity in a sales role has really vanished and is not coming back. When I authored Reaching the Top of the Game for the MBA in 2001, uh, the top originators stayed at their lenders for a long time. Today, job hopping is the norm and companies are faced with high turnover. This all translates into weak customer retention for the lender and the constant battle for acquiring new production any way possible. In my view, not holding originators accountable means tolerating weak sales performance. This is all due to not having a bench to replace loan officers who leave. With no bench, even the bad sales employee is at least a warm body who may be successful. I said, and maybe they are successful, but it's not likely. The manager can secretly hope that AI and robots will replace the human side of mortgage sales, but I don't think that's going to happen in the near future. While it's important to invest in technology, the industry needs to recognize that just as important is our commitment to having an excellent sales force. This requires to focus not just on recruiting people in mortgage, but reaching outside of industry and developing them. It is in the manager's self-interest to staff a bench that can replace the top producer who tells you they are moving on. In this sales world today, within two years, the manager will face this problem. So be smart and do something now about it. 